Hello and welcome to this video about the Altis CDT1. It's a second unit. This one came from Malaysia. My regular customer actually went there and picked up this uh, transport for his friend. He couldn't have it fixed there. So um, it's a bit of a milestone for me. I never had a, the one actually uh, delivered to me from another country or from another continent. This was truck 8. And this is track 15, so it plays and interpolates um, uh, purposely faulty tracks uh, like these. Um, what was wrong with it? Uh, I'm not going to talk more about this unit because it's not that remarkable, even though it still fetches 1500 euros. Um, it, um, it had a broken board. I needed laser replacement and a faulty remote which I repaired and um, and something oh there was a one of those um, posts was broken off and something else I don't I don't remember what it was but anyway um, it works now reasonably well still hasn't got original puck it's got the Mark Levinson puck uh, I don't know if uh, if this is good or bad, um, but it seems to work fine. Um, it is not great. The plays any CD is fine, but it's not great on CDRs, and I think some server chips needs to be replaced. I mean, this is a CDR, a very scratched one. Uh, oh, still, uh, see, it doesn't know. It doesn't know that it is a different disk. It still displays. Now it will know. Okay. And that's right. So it's just good. So um, that's all, folks. And, and this is a CDR. I plays them, but not um, not great. You know, it, uh, it will sort of probably play from beginning to end but it's no good for jumping up I mean, this this is this is extremely scratch CDR it still plays it but um, but if I sort of picked some track at the end uh, it uh, it might not be that good um, it probably needs replacement of the three chips on the server board or one of the three chips but there's no manual for it no um, diagram or anything, no information, so it's really stubbing in the dark. Um, I, I looked at the um, A14 modulation on the, and, and it that look fine, and uh, but there's no adjustment on it at all. There is a bit of server adjustment, it doesn't do basically anything, so uh, you know, the, 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 if the customer wants a more reliable CDR operation, then uh, there are three servo chips. So I'll give him model numbers, and 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 possibly that will fix it. Uh, and I, I, as I've said before, I have no idea what uh, what's going on on that board with three crystals and uh, some cleverness there. Well, thank you very much, and till the next one.